I'm Lori, and this is Blonde Diva Diamond Paints. Welcome back to the channel. Today I'm doing a fan sales unboxing. It is going to be a canvas that both Star Wars fans and Marilyn Monroe fans are going to appreciate. Bet you can't guess what it's going to be. Hey guys, so today I'm doing an unboxing for fan cells. This is a company that I haven't actually purchased from before, but I've heard a lot of things about it lately and I wanted to see for myself. So I did go onto their website and I searched through what they had to offer. They have a lot of diamond paintings to choose from. I chose this one simply because I actually own the print version of this artwork and I wanted to do a comparison between the artwork versus the diamond painting and I won't get into a lot of detail about that right now because I am going to do a second video once I've completed this diamond painting I'm going to do kind of a comparison between the two and I'll go into more details as to why I have that painting and so forth so for today it's simply going to be an unboxing for fan cells so uh, talking about this kit right here, I purchased this at the end of July and I received it about two weeks later. So the shipping time was really uh, reasonable, I thought, for this diamond painting. The price is extremely economical, I guess you could say. All of their diamond paintings are really affordable. Um, I'm trying to put this a, a nice way. So to give you an example, I paid right around $10 for this, including shipping. And I paid more for the shipping than I did on the actual diamond painting kit. So I don't know what that means to you, but to me that says that maybe once we open this, you know, the diamond painting may not be of the best quality. We'll just have to see. So um, let's get into the unboxing or unwrapping, whatever you want to call it. So this came in just a um, paper, you know, paper mailer. And then on the inside it had the bubble wrap. And I did kind of pre-open it because I was so curious to see what this canvas looked like. So um, I'm going to unroll it here. It does have that clear cover on the front, which I love that it does have that. Let me roll it back a little bit here and I'll kind of show you what the image is. And if you were watching in my little, you know, intro teaser thing, you could see what the artwork is supposed to look like. And this is what the diamond painting looks like. So it is, Let's see if I can get that up there where you can kind of see. It is a picture of Marilyn Monroe wearing the Darth Vader suit, costume, outfit, whatever you want to call it. I don't want to offend the Star Wars fans. Believe me, I live with one. So it's not real clear. I mean, this particular one, it only came in one size. It is a 30 by 40 centimeter, and you will not believe this, my cat is walking around on my table. So if you see him in the frame, I'm sorry. But um, it has 25 colors. 25, I don't know if you can see that there. And let's look at the symbols. The symbols are you know, the symbols are really good. They're really clear. And I don't see any that are similar to one another. So as far as the symbols go, that's, that's an A+. Plus. I like that. They all appear to be either numbers or letters. There's no, you know, no shapes, nothing like that. All numbers or letters and a total of 25 colors here it does have the dmc codes off to the side there is a legend here on the left side the upper left side 
and also on the bottom right side. So that's really helpful. Let's see how sticky the canvas is. It's not bad. It, it could be stickier. Um, it seems sticky enough, if that makes sense. So, um, could be stickier, but not bad. And the actual glue runs off about, I don't know if you can see my finger there, but the glue overlaps about like that on the right side. Oops, I stuck my hand to it. Um, about the same on the bottom. About right there on the left side. So that side's better than the right side, I believe. And then up here at the top, it runs right to the canvas on the top. So, yeah. The glue, you know how, um, you know how Diamond Art Club's canvases have that kind of sparkle to it? This one is not as intense as that Diamond Art Club sparkle, but it does have a sparkle to it. And the weight of the canvas is pretty nice. It's not super stiff. Um, it's not, it's not Diamond Art Club. Again, comparing it to Diamond Art Club, it's not that, you know, soft velvety canvas. But the canvas really feels nice. It has structure to it, but it's not super stiff. So I'm really happy with that. I think, uh, well, looking at it right now, wait a minute. Let me reserve my thoughts till the end, and then I'll tell you what I think. Um, so let's get on to, let's look at the kit that it comes with. So it comes with a plastic bag that holds just your basic green boat, a single placer, pink pen, and a small pink wax, just one. So, I mean, for the size of the kit, that is reasonable. Uh, that won't be a problem there. And let's look at the drills, and it's probably going to be loud for you, and I'm sorry. So those are just in a little plastic envelope, and then you have the strips of the drills. This particular kit is a round drill kit. these turned around here. So I have two strips here. And let's look at the drills. Can you see that? I mean, I think the drills look pretty good. Not bad for a $10 or less kit. And I say $10 and I mean shipping too. I don't know I said that before, but I don't know if you caught that or not. I pay more for the shipping than I did for the diamond painting. It's just insane. So um, let me look at this one here. I have a lot of those purple colors. And all of these bags, I mean, the drills look okay. Um, most of these bags I can pick out that there is some spillage. I don't know if you can see that or not, but most of the bags contain a little bit of a different color in it. Not bad, um, but that's just not, that's just not as clean as some. This brown especially, this purple was right next to it when it got sealed. There are at least three things of purple in that that I can see right offhand. Yeah. So, but I mean, there's nothing, they're not stuck together. It looks pretty good, it looks pretty good, you know. Um, let's see, yeah. So, pinks, purples, blues. I can't wait to get started on this. So, um, 
what do I think about this? For the price and the quality, I am impressed. Um, I like the clear cover. I like the symbols on the canvas. I like the drills, they look good. The canvas could be a little bit stickier. And of course, the resolution of the image is very much lacking. This canvas at a 30 by 40 centimeter is really too small to be able to see the details in this artwork. That is the glaring problem with this particular kit. Other than that, I think if you had gone online and purchased one that had less detail, if it was, you know, just a single image, just a flower or just a cat or something, something smaller without all of this going on, I think it would have been a good kit. Um, I will see how it comes out. And like I said, I am going to be doing a secondary video for this and uh, showing it off once I get it completed. If you have any questions, please feel free to reach out to me. I'm always here for you. And I will see you on Tuesday for Tuesday night, drilling and chilling. Yes, I'm probably going to be working on this canvas here. <laughs>